Why? <laughs> For well, a very good reason, Heather. I know. It never gets old to watch that, although it does make me shiver even here, fully clothed in a warm studio. That was Team PTL at the Polar Plunge last year. It's coming up again. <sighs> now, the Polar Plunge raises awareness and money for Special Olympics. The money raised at that annual February event helps send athletes to competitions all around Pennsylvania free of charge. One of those competitions is happening this weekend. It's a bowling tournament and Daisy is helping some of those athletes warm up this morning. Good morning, Daisy. Hi guys. Yes, looking at that footage, it makes you wonder why in the world did we plunge? But it is again for a great cause for the Special Olympics. And they actually have another competition this weekend. I'm actually here with Andrew Fee, who's the executive director of the Three Rivers region. Yes, okay. Yeah. Yes. So I know that you guys have a very special competition coming up this weekend, but first tell people that may not be familiar with what exactly the Special Olympics do. Yeah, Special Olympics, uh, we provide sporting opportunities for people with intellectual disabilities, uh, specifically in the Three Rivers region for Southwest PA. Uh, we offer 22 different sports. We also offer athlete leadership training and health uh, and sport, uh, health and sport opportunities. Uh, yes. There you see some bowling footage uh, from prior competitions, but this will actually be our first bowling regional championship that we've ever hosted here in Pittsburgh. So let me ask you a question. Why bowling? I mean, obviously, some people think it's a sport. Some people don't think it's a sport. I think it's a sport. But why, why is bowling so popular? Well, it's a very inclusive sport. A lot of people can participate. So we have people that utilize wheelchairs that participate. We have people uh, that... Uh, can't always hold the ball with their fingers that we have yeah. adaptations where they can participate. So it's a really inclusive sport and it's a lifelong sport. So that's why I think uh, our athletes enjoy it most, but also the social opportunities with bowling. You know, you take, you throw two balls, you go back yeah, uh, and, and are out. able to hang out and talk. And the social opportunities within Special Olympics are so important too. Absolutely. And, and you said that this competition that's coming up is going to uh, allow them to be a part of the, the Winter Games in York. Correct? Yes, our indoor Winter Games. They can qualify by winning a gold medal here uh, to our indoor Winter Games. Uh, because we have so many bowlers across the state, not everyone that wins the gold can go, um, but that's a really special opportunity them, for them to continue to qualify uh, for the uh, indoor Winter Games. Yeah, so I know that you guys do a lot of special um, competitions throughout the year and what why do you think that this one actually brings so many people out again we have so many bowlers across the state and you see pictures uh, that we're going through there of athletes going all the way to USA games in Orlando yeah. Florida to bowl uh, so there's a lot of opportunities for them to advance uh, so bowling again really inclusive really special sport uh, all of our athletes enjoy participating in it and this is why we plunge right absolutely we, all these programs are absolutely free of charge to our athletes uh, and that's why we continue to promote and push the polar plunge yeah. so our athletes get opportunities like this i love that 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 those those um opportunities allow people to actually you know be able to participate in these games now we actually have two special bowlers here we have ben and jeff and they are totally like kicking my butt and we want to see what you. yeah <laughs> we want to see what you guys have to do because you guys have uh much better skill at this than me Thank so <laughs> all right let's go guys first up is ben oh and jeff oh my gosh we got a strike Woo! Good job, Ben and Jeff. All right, now we got to see how well I can do. I don't know. They've been giving me tips all morning, but we'll see. That was a bad one. Oh! <laughs> hey, I, I got number one. That's all right. Fun, fun, all right, fun, but fun. You know what? There's room for improvement there, Daisy. And I thought your form was good. I thought your release yeah. was good. I'm loving this. This is so all right, great. Let's see. Strike, strike, strike. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, oh. That's so close. So close, oh, Jeff. Two pins so close. left. All right, lots of fun. Thank you so much, Daisy. And thanks to the Special Olympics for inviting us there today to get a little preview of Absolutely. the fun that they're having. And remember, the Three Rivers Bowling Tournament is this Sunday. The Polar Plunge, though, happens February 25th. Yeah, and you can still help Team PTL because we have a group plunging again this year. We're going to put a link on our Team PTL for the Polar Plunge, on the Polar Plunge page, I should say, on our website, PittsburghTodayLive.com, so that you can make pledges.